jumping all around. But the title of this video is How Shea Butter Cleared My Skin. I'm not making this up. This Shea Butter, people, cleared my skin. Welcome back to my channel. This is Journeys with Chris. Are you ready? I'm going to make this really quick to the point because I'm not a reviewer, okay? I'm a bringer of the truth. Um, it's been three weeks. My girls went to Ghana, Denise and Charlene, and they brought me back. They were just like, Chris, you know what? We're going to bring you back something from the motherland. We're going to bring you back Shea Butter. I was like, okay, bring it along. Guys, this has been the best thing yet. Like, okay, my intention was to probably make this up with some type of oils, you know, to give it like a really nice scent and just slap it on my body. But I haven't gotten a chance to do that. I haven't even gotten a chance to put this in a jar, okay? This is it. Um, so in the morning when I get out the shower, I get just I just really have dry skin and I don't have the time to do my makeup every day, but I still want to look like fresh popping just a hint of a dash of something nice anyways guys so i just put this on and i just feel i just feel i just feel good and the best thing about this is three weeks later shea butter has cleared my skin and i'm on the road to like redemption to like shining shining guys okay so for those that don't know i suffered from acne Sorry about that noise. Um, I suffered from acne from a very young age. I think I got acne when I was first 12 and throughout my, you know, my, my teens and going into my early 20s. They, they said when puberty hit, it would go away. It didn't. I went to the doctors. They put you on some, like, really burning stuff. And then I come home and I'm, like, even trying to burn my skin some more because, like, I'm so self-conscious. You know when you have stuff on your face, you don't feel your best. But I was just like, I cannot come and kill myself in 2018. But, like, in 2018, this is my best yet I found shea butter guys I'm living my best life honestly truly I kid you not um this is some good stuff it's straight from Ghana straight from the motherland straight from the it's raw so you know it's really it's natural that's the best thing you could put on your skin okay so I don't know if you guys are gonna have the opportunity to try this on your own if you're not from Ghana or if you know anyone definitely give this a try try maybe the African markets I know they sell uh raw shea butter and then also my friend is coming out with a product like a skin line for shea butter um no sorry shea butter base for coco girls for girls like us and i'm gonna put the link down below give her a follow look into this if you're suffering from acne if you have scars if you have spotting if you look like a pizza i used to look like a pizza this has really done it for me and I'm just gonna take the time to jump into like other things that I use on my face, you know. Before I met the Shea Butter three weeks ago, there was a lifestyle, there was a routine that I was used to. So first, I use this in the morning to just, you know, scrub my face. I really like this. This is the Morning Burst Facial Scrub. Who doesn't like a facial scrub? And this is from Clean and Clear. If you've not tried it, try it. It's for sensitive skin. I don't know what's inside, but it's really nice for exfoliating your skin and what I also like is this the clean the clean sorry the clear complexion from Avino active natural it really helps with the breakouts and it helps with evening your skin out it did its job but not as good as the shea butter did it but I'm still on it because I just like the foam on my skin so I'm gonna recommend this as well do they come together this is just regular cooking oil just kidding this is apple cider vinegar vinegar guys Everyone should know what a mask is or should love a mask. On a Saturday when you're home and you're just relaxing, you've had a long week, slap on your mask, Jerry. Slap it on. Slap it on. Because it kind of sucks out the oils from your skin. It sucks out that, like, creamy butter looking stuff, you know, the gross. I mean, come on. You know what I'm talking about. Um, so this is really good for you. Uh, this is the Health and Beauty Azek. AZ Secret Indian Healing Clay and you can find this on Amazon. All the products that I'm recommending are $10 or less. We're not going back to a dermatologist. I don't, my insurance is not, the way my insurance is set up, I don't have time for it. And I'm in my, you know, my mid 20s. Oh my God, I'm about to be 25. And anyway, so I have to find stuff that works for me, that my skin likes, that's, you know, inexpensive and just fitting in the budget. So I'm gonna recommend this. You can just have it on, sorry guys. Um, I don't know why I have sweatpants. Oh my gosh, let's move on. Sorry about that. But um, I'm definitely going to recommend this. Now I'm like so conscious. I'm, like, eh. um, I'm definitely going to recommend this. Like give, give this a try. Like just for, uh, you know, like it's just a feel good kind of thing. This is really good for your skin. And also, 
I'm gonna recommend black soap this is from Ghana from the girls as well go to the African market try black soap this is some raw stuff it's probably gonna be like $15 but it's so worth it there's nothing better than putting good stuff you know you have to treat your skin with care but we all know this so um, I'm coming at you from the African edition you know just going straight back to the motherland and also I have the Mario the Badescu skincare. I like this gly glycolic foaming cleanser. It kind of, it's very tingling, you know? It just feels good on the skin. I saw some really good recommendations about this. So here and there, I just throw it in there because it's kind of, it's 18 bucks. I'm using it parsimoniously. We're not just gonna be wasting the, the foam, eh? Eh? And also, that's it, guys. And when you're done clearing your skin, Get yourself a nice glass of red wine, sangria, whatever you guys like to drink. Actually, this morning I made myself a green smoothie, but I'm just feeling spicy. Guys, anyways, that's it for the video. Please, 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 if you enjoyed this, give this a thumbs up. I'm coming at you in 2018 with a lot more energy because that's just the kind of person that I am, okay? Um, thank you guys for joining in. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you for watching this video all the way to the end. I appreciate every single one of you, and I'm so glad you're going with me on this journey. Bye!